Early Childhood, and Life. James and Dolores Jordan. Welcomed, Michael Jeffrey Jordan, into the world on February 17, 1963 in Brooklyn, New York. Michael attended Emsley A. Laney High School in Wilmington, where he discovered his passion for sports like football, baseball, and basketball. He joined the school's junior basketball team rather than feeling down. He won over everyone's admiration and was selected for the McDonald's All-American team, the top high school basketball team. As a senior in collegiate high school he played for teams such as North Carolina, Virginia, Duke, and Syracuse. As a result of his achievements in basketball in 1981, he received a scholarship offer from the University of North Carolina and received a degree in cultural geography from college. Dean Smith, a famous basketball coach, coached him there, and the Atlantic Coast Conference honored Michael Jordan as freshman of the year, fighting Georgetown University in the NCAA championships in 1982 was an important component in the team's victory career. In 1984, he dropped out of university with the aim of joining the NBA draft. The young basketballer was selected by Chicago Bulls. After players Hakeem Olajuwon and Sam Bowie were chosen by Houston Rockets and Portland Trail Blazers respectively, Jordan was the winner of the 1984 Summer Olympics alongside Sam Perkins Steve Alford, and Patrick Ewing. After returning to school, Michael Jordan earned his degree from the University of North Carolina two years later. 1984 to 1987 Jordan played for the Chicago Bulls a team that did not have much success. He averaged an above average 28.2 points per game during that time the Bulls lost to the Milwaukee Bucks in the playoffs every season he plays passionately leading his squad to the playoffs he set a record for the NBA by recording 100 blocks and 200 steals in one season the Bulls did somewhat better than before, despite losing to the Boston Celtics in the playoffs. In the first season of the NBA playoffs from 1987 to 1990, the new Chicago Bulls star guided his squad to championship games. But the Detroit Pistons, coached by Isaiah Thomas, beat the Bulls every season eliminating them from the playoffs. Michael Jordan led the Bulls to the Eastern Conference Finals in the following 1990-91 season. His squad was once again against the Detroit Pistons. Michael Jordan led the Bulls to the Eastern Conference Finals in the following 1990-91 season. His squad was once again against the Detroit Pistons. The Chicago Bulls defeated the Blazers and the Phoenix Suns in the ensuing two seasons, earning three titles in a row. He was once more a part of the so-called Dream Squad at the 1992 Summer Olympics, a group of gifted athletes that won a gold medal, including Magic Johnson, David Robinson, and Larry Bird. The well-known basketball player 
was allegedly caught gambling. In 1993, an accusation, he admitted to in an interview, with the 60 Minutes program. He publicly announced, his decision to retire that same year, on October 6th and cited, his father's murder as one, of the motivations. He was caught gambling in 1993, an accusation he admitted in, an interview with, the 60 Minutes program. He signed a baseball contract, with the Chicago White Sox, the following season. Michael Jordan used this to fulfill, his father's wish to watch, his son play baseball. The Chicago Bulls struggled, in the NBA Finals, without their star player, on the roster. He quit baseball, in 1995 and switched back, to basketball, joining the Bulls. The Indiana Pacers were, opponents in his, comeback game, which the Bulls won. Then beat the Atlanta Hawks, and the New York Knicks. The Bulls, were unable to secure, a win against the Orlando Magic, in the Eastern Conference, semifinals. Michael is averaging 31 points, per game, but the Orlando Magic, are still winning the season. Jordan competed in three NBA, championship seasons, between 1995 and 1998, beating the Utah Jazz, and the Seattle Supersonics, in two championship games. He became the sixth player, to receive the NBA Finals, Most Valuable Player, MVP, award. January 13, 1999, Jordan decided to retire both, and return the following year, to lead the Washington Wizards. He returned to play again, in 2001 and worked diligently, to get back into shape. He called, on former Chicago Bulls, coach Doug Collins to teach, his team at the Washington Wizards. On September 25th of the same year, he decided to play basketball, for the Washington Wizards, and gave his entire salary to help, the victims of the 9-11 attacks, in the 2001-2002 season. He didn't play much because, of a bad knee injury. He broke Kareem Abdul-Jabbar's, record for the most points, scored in a game, against, the Philadelphia 76ers in an NBA, All-Star game. However, the Washington Wizards lost, as a result of multiple willful, fouls committed against Michael. After his retirement, Michael Jordan was relieved, of his duties as president, of the Washington Wizards, and founded the Michael Jordan, Motorsports Organization in 2004. Two years later, he acquired a majority stake in, the operations of the NBA team, Charlotte Bobcats and later, became a partial owner, recognition, and achievements. Jordan won numerous NBA awards, between 1984 and 1988, including Rookie of the Year, Defensive Player of the Year, and Slam Dunk Contest Champion, and several times won, the NBA Championship. In 1984 Jordan received, a gold medal for his contribution, to the Olympic basketball team, which won the gold medal. He received the Sportsman, of the Year Award from Sports, illustrated in 1991. He received a second gold medal, for his team's Olympic triumph, the following year. Numerous publications, including Slam and ESPN Sports, 
have named Michael Jordan as one of the greatest sports figures. Both the Naismith Memorial and the North Carolina Museum of History have inducted him into their respective halls of fame.